Hello and welcome. How are you doing today? To today and next I am planning to show you that how I disassemble and I remove this gear stick and those manual transmission gears, cables, joints in this this um, gearbox area and this engine area. And and next we look these cables in here and those joints. And and first step is that we need to set up our cars this transmission and gearbox stick to neutral and like zero position. And then we have those settings in that way. And first this uh, gear stick to neutral and it's the first first step and then then I start to take those joints and those metallic pins away and there is idea that I need first these tongs and this is my first target and in here there is idea that that this pin opens so that that I take my tongs in here and then I pull out in that direction and then it opens so nicely. And this is this Toyota and there is that kind of pin. What what is in here? And then there is also some, actually one support plate in here, what I I took away, there's that kind of metallic pin, and then, then I open that joint so that I take my hand and I move that cable a little bit and now it's free. It's like free in there and then there's second what is almost similar joint and it's in here that cable and, and then I only pull out and there is similar metallic similar metallic this metallic part in there and it's, it's look like in that way and this is special Toyota part and if if this is missing we can go to purchase in new in Toyota dealership. Okay. And then I take that next metallic plate out too. It is in here. And there is this metallic plate similar than than this previous and then I take also that cable out that I a little bit move that and and then I use my screw flat flat screwdriver and I a little bit bend I a little bit bend that that this opens okay and now now this is free also. That part. okay, both of those are free. Good. And and then this was like start and then in here in these joints in here there's metallic plate. But normally can be quite quite tight but let's go what happens there is this and a little bit movement and pull out pull out in this way and, so, and yes this opens there is that kind of metallic blade 
what is like locking part and it goes in in that way and then it locks these cables. And this is also Toyota's special part if this is too corrosion and rusty. Okay, let's look then. Next one, what is right in there? What happens in that? And this looks like this looks to be more rusty. Okay, and now this part is really, really st stuck. And I take bigger tongs next. Okay, and then I have bigger tongs and another one, and I try what I can do with these. Can I open that now? Is this so so rusty and so difficult to open? Speeds. Yeah. This part is this part is very very tight. Okay, and let's see that what I invent next. I need more tools. Okay. And then I invented that I had this long crow bar. What is really big. This is maybe the biggest one. And this length is something like one, two, three and four feet long and that means that that this is then like then this microbar is really long this length is like four feet and like one hundred and and fifty centimeters and then I invented that in always when we are planning to take some parts out. This is this target area and then in here here there is suitable support place that I can insert that my tool in here like in this bending area. Okay that's good. Then I I can set up this in very nicely in this position then I have then I have a really long force in here. It starts in here and then it continues from he there there is the super bar in super point in just in here. There is the super point. Actually it was in 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 here in that position. And then this my bar continues, it goes in here and it is in so there is this end. Okay. And then I start to test that. But can I now take this metallic part away? Okay, let's see. Let's see what happens. Okay, good. And then, then I start a little bit paint that. And what happens? Now I insert more force. Okay, and it moves up. Excellent. Okay, now now it is a little bit up. 
but I need in here more this this uh, I need to lift up this my system a little bit up and I need small plate in there or okay and then I have in here piece of wood and I insert that my part in here I can support plate and carefully carefully in here and then I then I try to move that more up let's see that what happens what happens in this system more force that okay now it opens excellent excellent now this part is away in there and I lift that part in in this ground and now this joint is is free okay and this is free and also that one is in, in here this is free okay excellent and then those both those both cables are now free. Okay, and here, here was this the final plate, what is very rusty and corrosion, but still workable. Okay, and then I checked that that these parts are similar. Okay, like in Toyota way. In some other cars, this could be in different size, of course, that we have more complexity, but not in Toyota. Okay, and then, then I do in here those my markings, that I mark, mark those cables and this, this, uh, this, First cable is number number twenty number twenty-five and I insert these cables in in there so the first there is twenty-five and it, it comes in in here and I take that away and I insert that 20, 25 tape that part in this position in here and this is like 25 ok and then this next one what is in here this is then Next number, and it's like then 26. It's 26, and 26 comes in here. Okay, and there's 20. 26 is that cable, and in that that label 26 becomes in that that area in here okay and 26 position 26 place was that hole in here and this is 25 hole okay good and <coughs> That was that transmission cables remove and thank you for watching and we continue.